What is going on fellow farmers? CJ Farms here and today we are back with another beginner's guide tutorial right here on FS22. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, smash that like button for me and click that bell and click also know exactly when I post new content and when I go live. And if you want to get your hands on some amazing and awesome giant software gear and help out the CJ Farms YouTube channel in the process, check out the links below with the blue diamonds beside it guys. Go grab your giant software gear and help support CJ Farms. With that being said, let's get on with the video. Alright guys and girls, so today we're going to be talking about the Lime Factory in FS22. Um, there's a few factories in the game that we're going to be discussing here in the next few days and uh, doing tutorials on. Uh, this one here is the Lime Factory. Let me pop up here so you guys can get a better look at it. Uh, so your input pretty much goes right here. <clears throat> this is your input and then your output comes out right here. And this is the Lime Factory here guys. It's a very nice factory. Um, it's pretty simple. It's not very hard to use. Um, if we go into the store, go down to other and go to construction, and then go to production, and go to factories, okay? I'm going to scroll all, almost all the way down to the end, and your lime production factory is right here. It's a lizard uh, lime production factory. Lime factory. Uh, it is $80,000, okay? And this is going to be your factory right here. You just pull it out. You can, you can rotate it or whatever you want to do. Uh, but that's your factory right here. We're going to be discussing all these factories here, guys. Yesterday we did the, um, I believe yesterday, we what, what did we do yesterday? We did one of the, well, we did one yesterday. I can't remember what it was, but we did one yesterday. Um, but with that being said, let's go ahead and get into this, guys. So the first thing you're going to need to do is you're going to have to walk up to this little gear right here. Um, and as you guys can see what it says right there, the storage is empty. You're going to click on this little gear. And this is where it's going to show you what you need to input, okay? So we're going to need stones. And from the stones, the factory produces it, crushes it up, whatever it's got to do, and it produces lime. Now, before you put anything in, uh, go ahead down here in the left corner and click activate. Make sure that this is on, okay? Make sure it's on. Uh, make sure that, and it will tell you, if nothing's in there, it'll say material's missing, all right? So right here, you need rocks. You need stones, okay? So... Uh, of course, we're already ready to go. We've got some rocks in our trailer here. Now, if you are going to haul, haul stones, no matter what tractor you may be in, make sure you get a weight. Okay, make sure you have a weight for the front of your tractor because uh, a trailer full of stones can tend to make you ride a wheelie a little bit, all right? So we're going to go ahead, and what we're going to do is we're going to back this tractor uh, up into this little spot right here. All right, as you can see right there. And we're gonna go ahead and dump our stones in. There they go. And what this does is it's like it's it's almost like the debris crusher mod, right? It crushes up your rock and then it turns it into lime. Now, if you want factories like this, guys, uh, it's it's a cool little feature to have, in my opinion. Uh, I might start using it myself, and I think we're glitched out here. I think we are glitched out. So we still got. Um, rock and I'm not too sure why it's okay that's just uh, let me let me pull out all right let me go ahead and empty that trailer there we go all right so let's shut this off and let's hop over to now there's two ways you can get to your factory uh, menu you can do it by going over to that little gear and clicking on it or you can go into your menu like this and from the top you're gonna go down to this little icon right here okay your production chains and right here you will see that we have um, 11,997 stones now these stones are gonna start dropping down because it's crushing the stones up and making it into lime okay um, 
Uh, now, right here, guys, you can see that um, your production cost per month is sixty dollars. So every time the month passes, it's going to charge you uh, a fee of sixty dollars for using the factory. Okay. Uh, now, keep in mind, any other factories on the map that, like, if you if you buy if you if you download a map, right, and it has factories on it, just be sure you own those factories. Now, this factory right here, we already own because we bought it from the um, we bought it from the store. Okay. So if you go in the store, go to construction. And you go in here. Any of these factories that you buy are already owned because you buy them right here from the store, okay? Uh, so, with that being said, let's go ahead. Go back to the menu here. Let's go to production chains. As you can see, the lime is going up and the stones is dropping down, okay? So, let's go ahead and speed the time up here a little bit. Oh, look at that thing at night, guys. Check that out. That's pretty cool. That is that is litty titty right there. Litty titty. All right. And then, let's go ahead and keep speeding the time up a little bit. Speed up a little bit more. There we go. And let's go back to the production chains. And it takes a while for them to go up. And for this to drop down, it does take a little bit. So just, just be patient, guys. Uh, but that is pretty much how you do it. Now, if I go up there right now and get some lime, there's not going to be much. Um, but uh, I, I, I'm trying to figure out a way to speed up the process with this thing. I don't know if it... So now, yeah, as long as, as, long as you speed the time up... You should be good to go, but just just remember, every time it goes through that month, if you have your day set to one month days like I do, uh, my settings are on one month days right here. One, I'm sorry, one day month. Sorry about that. One day months. So every time the day passes, a month passes by for me, as you can see, and you'll see where it charges. Uh, well, six hundred ninety for the property maintenance for the building itself. So we keep going here. We keep going. I like watching how that sun comes over like that. Check it out. Look at that. That's so cool. All right, so we'll go back around to noon here, and then we'll see where it's at. There we go. Bam! Right on the dot. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Right on the dot. We'll freeze the time right there. Uh, and now let's go back in our production chains, and you will see now you're up to 10 liters of lime. But that's pretty much how it works, guys. There's not much to it. Uh, you just get some stone. I right, collect your stone, put it in here, and... Um, go here just tell you what you need and then you drop your rock here and you get your lime out from right here now i can i can show you guys i can pull the trailer under there and it's not it's gonna be it's gonna spit it's pretty much gonna spit out lime like just it's gonna, gonna be a little bit of lime that's all it's gonna do so i can show you guys here um it's not gonna be much and i and i promise you it's it's gonna be just a little bit see that <laughs> Now, I don't know if we can put this back into <laughs> the factory or not. I'm going to find out. You should be able to be in the fact it produces lime. You should be able to put the lime back in there. Uh, I don't know if you can. Yeah, you can. You can. So that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, like I said, you just got to wait for the factory to produce the lime. But that is pretty much it for this tour, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, subscribe if you're new, smash that like button for me, click that bell, and click also to know exactly when I post new content and when I go live. That being said, until next time, guys and girls, stay safe, stay awesome, and be humble. I will see you all in the next video.